dear students how are you hope you are well today it's gonna be very important video for you uh, especially who already registered for the TOLS exam and you are waiting for the test day uh, do you know what equipments do you need during the test do you need a laptop or a mobile phone do you need good internet connection or how should be the room configuration and uh, is it okay to stay with you like uh, someone if they want to stay with you so we'll know all of those stuff so let's start so this is the uh, this is the pdf i downloaded from cz website all instruction actually written here if you read carefully then you will understand but i uh, i just want to explain with you and there are nice beautiful pictures so it's easy to understand how uh, you will see it and what equipments you can keep there and how uh, long it could be uh, how would be the internet connection or technical steps are written in this P in this pdf format so you can download this pdf from the cz website and uh, you can read them i suggest you read it very carefully because a lot of information given those are really important so the title of this slide is uh, Tol's home home test uh, home test room configuration testing and network requirements so of course uh, as you are from uh, you are joining the test uh, from a foreign country so you you must register for Tol's home not Tol's on site so in that case the supervisor or the test taker must ensure whether you are uh, you are not cheating okay or you are following the rules and regulation therefore you need two devices a laptop and a mobile phone or tablets okay so we'll discuss about it uh, here so in this space We'll discuss what sort of things you need for example a laptop you must need a mobile phone or a tablet also okay um, and then you are allowed to have a blank a piece of paper with pen or pencil in case uh, you need to use them for calculation or doing some or writing something uh, okay during the test so th those are allowed but you're not allowed to have any books or written uh, pages okay so you have to be careful and both devices this both devices like mobile phone and, and computer should have good internet connection very good internet connection okay so f in mobile phone you have to install a zoom application so the tutor i mean the test taker will send you a link and you should join the link and during the test you should place your mobile phone such a position that that uh, test uh, test taker or supervisor can see you through the mobile phone and by this laptop you will access a certain website cz website practice area and you will be given a link so if you click on the link there will be online exam so you will just see the questions and you will you can select them and during that time if you need any rough use then you can use uh, in the piece, uh, blank piece a uh, blank page and the pencil so that's okay but you cannot you cannot uh, have any book or any help uh, around you so no one can be with you you should have in a uh, single room and there should be a single door okay and room should have good lighting and now what else we'll we'll actually discuss uh, step by step so a stable internet connection is very important i already told you and another thing that is very important is ev browser so when you will uh, access the practice area post practice area you will see there is a link if you click on the link you can this scv browser 
will automatically download it so you, you need to install it okay otherwise you can't uh, you can't open the test link so be careful this is the very important step but if you do some simulation uh, you should have actually you should before the actual test you should have uh, you uh, use tolls simulation okay in that case you need to download the acb so if you have already acb then it's not a problem so toll simulation what is toll simulation toll simulation is uh, just uh, practicing okay practice materials online it's re uh, it's mimicking the real exam so if you practice a toll simulation that means you will know how the exam is working everything you will know uh, so it's beneficial i recommend you to do more and more toll simulation I, uh, okay this is stuff i already discussed with you and if you want to know more technical stuff then here everything is written okay like should there be any technical problems during the tolls uh, simulation please check that so during the toll simulation what kind of technical problem you may encounter those are uh, based on those issues there are some recommendation so if you read them uh, you will understand for example you should check you have deactivated the antivirus disabled automatic system updates and have only the applications required for the simulation open okay mm. okay i'm just uh, highlighting the important step others are automatically um, installed in your computer so you don't have to think about them i'm just uh, covering the important aspects for example about the internet connection you should have 600 kbps uploading speed and 1.2 mbps downloading speed so you can check this uh, through the speed test you can search on google that uh, speed test online then you can check it so it's not a big deal and about the pc there is some instruction like you should have intel 2 gigahertz and core i3 or higher is okay and 4 gb ram uh, uh, is okay is that's completely fine and windows 10 or later so make sure you have windows 10 and your pc has good resolution this is also important and you should use either google chrome mozilla firefox microsoft edge but do not use internet explorer okay so next page we're gonna discuss a few more room configuration okay so from this picture it's actually clear that this is the table and here the laptop you can use some paper you can keep them uh, there should should have a light if there isn't enough then this is your chair and in 45 degree angle you should place a desk or any tripod tripod also okay you uh, because uh, it's needed to keep your phone okay so it should be in at least a, a 45 degree angle so so your whole body and also the pc can be seen by the test supervisor so you can use book for, for a support to keep your phone and if you have tripod that's completely fine in that case you don't need this stuff and you know, what should be the distance from your chair so there is roughly uh, there is a uh, roughly distance written here 1.5 meters from the position from the chair this text should be 1.5 meter and what would be the height of your uh, desk or tripod it's also same 1.5 meters and make sure your your computer and mobile phone both are connected with the uh, connected uh, with the electricity like uh, just think sometimes it may take a couple of hours because you have to wait sometimes because there are many students so tutor will come sequentially one by one so in that case you may have to wait for 
a couple of hours to you know, for your turn so in that case make sure that you have enough battery in your laptop at least three hours or just it should be connected always with the uh, electricity so you can keep your disk either side but the, the, con the specification are the same okay mm -hmm. here's some other in, uh, instruction like during the test your door should have closed and must fall within the frame of the mobile device so the door actually you know uh, should be uh, seen by the focus of your mobile phone so your mobile phone is here so the tutor will ensure someone is not entering during the test okay so it's very important throughout the throughout the duration of the test it is not possible to use any electronic device accessories as earphone headphone smartwatch google glass microphone speakers you are not allowed to use them check that the camera on your mobile device have not capture objects present in the physical room that could reveal sensitive information such as book scare, scare text photographs and clothing so you have to you have to be careful like this uh, the focus of the camera uh, should be only the left of your decks yourself and the door a part of door nothing else okay so set up for the day of the uh, tolsom so you can just read them i think i should not uh, make a long video on it it's, uh, if you read them then you will understand and I already discussed this stuff what should be your clothes and how you will see it here so this actually represents the focus of your mobile phone so whole table yourself a part of your part of the door so it should be visible okay so these two figures represents like how you place your phone so you can use the books as a support no problem and okay this is the top view of your desk so i hope you guys understood if you need any more information just let me know i will be very happy to help you i'm always with you and if you still not uh, still didn't subscribe my channel please do it and like and comment and of course share with your friends or colleagues so it's of, uh, it will make me motivated to make more videos so today i want to finish right now so have a good time